Let us then with confidence draw near to the throne of grace that we may receive mercy and find grace to help in time of need. Hebrews 4, verse 16. Have you ever tried to reach the president of a large corporation by phone? Have you ever tried to secure a face-to-face meeting with a superstar? It's not all that easy. We get put on hold, asked a million questions, shuffled off to someone further down the chain of command, or told that we don't have the credentials to visit or see the person we're hoping to. That's not how God is. Jesus, who is the second person of the Trinity, true God and true man, came and lived among us, and now, as the one who has returned to the right hand of God, invites us to come to Him in our time of need. What we deserve when we come to Him is to be turned away, to be told that we're not worthy of being in His presence, but we experience instead the invitation to come, and not only to come, but to come boldly. When we come, The unexpected happens. We are welcomed and we're given the mercy and the grace that we so desperately need. Grace has been defined as not getting what we really do deserve and grace has been defined as getting what we don't deserve. God doesn't want us to go it alone. Instead, He gives us full access to the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. He's not just a corporate big shot or a social superstar. He's the creator and CEO of the entire universe. But he's also the one who humbled himself and came and lived among us and has an open door policy, whatever our need. Press on in the Lord.